paano mag-apply ng credit card online sa kay Union Bank. So, I'm going to share my experience. Was it easy? Was it smooth sailing? Anong ginawa ko? Ano ba yung mga na-encounter kong errors? So, I'll be showing screenshots and as we go along, I will be giving my opinion. Ever na mas-share ko sa inyo. So, if you want to know kung paano mag-apply ng credit card sa kay Union Bank online, then please keep watching. start with a disclaimer guys that this video is not sponsored it's entirely based on my experience in full disclosure lang guys I already have existing credit cards I have a secured credit card na inaplayan ko dun sa Metro Bank if you want to see a video of that you can go to the link in the description box below I also have an existing credit card na yung kay um, Security Bank like I said I'll be showing screenshots kung paano ako nag-apply sa kay Union Bank na um, credit card and I will tell you why I did this and why I did that. So, I started dun sa yung nakita ko sa Facebook, yung verified na parang sponsored message, kumbaga nagaling kay Union Bank na apply for a credit card. Tapos, pag ikinlik mo kasi yung link, mapupunta ka dun sa page kung saan may lalabas na <laughs> referral code or code, application code kung bale. I suggest na you do this on a computer or PC. Pag ginawa mo kasi sa cellphone, ang daming error, minsan ayaw niyang lumusot eh. Parang hindi masyadong smooth sailing kapag sa cellphone mo siya ginawa. Tapos palaging may nag error So, yung ginawa ko, dun ko siya ginawa sa PC. Full disclosure na rin, meron na rin akong existing savings account with Union Bank. And I believe ha, correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, opinion ko lang to, I think it's gonna be much easier if you already have an account, an existing account with Union Bank para tuloy-tuloy yung process kong baga. So, nakita ko yung lumabas sa Facebook, kinlik ko yun. And it took me to this page kung saan uh, mag apply ka na ng credit card. Or you can also go to the Union Bank website, you click um, you can log in or you can go to the credit card links na nasa website nila and just click apply and it will take you to the same page that looks exactly like this one. Alabas may referral code and then are you a Union Bank customer? It's not really necessary. My feelings can be wrong. It's much easier to apply kung meron ka ng existing account. But again, again, it's not necessary. So I said yes. And if you say yes, hingi niya yung account number mo with Union Bank or your credit card number. So, nilagay ko po yung savings account number ko doon. And then, I've heard from the grapevine <laughs> na mas madali daw ma-approve kung magsisimula ka doon sa Union Bank na um, classic Visa card because yung income requirements niya is lower compared to the other credit cards that Union Bank offers. If makapasa ako, i-update ko kayo. So next question is, do you have a principal credit card with another bank? I I checked, I put yes here. Pag nag-click ka ng yes, yung next question niya, yung follow-up question niya, yes at least 6 months and yes less than 6 months. So kung na-remember nyo, meron akong ginawang video kung paano ako nag-apply ng secured credit card with Metro Bank because I want to make my credit card videos like a journey for us, especially doon sa mga nakaka-relate. So yung secured credit card ko with Metro Bank, it's um, less than 6 months. So yung pinili ko for the purpose of getting more information na pwede kong ma-share sa inyo. So, mas madali bang makapasa kung more than 6 months sa yung credit card mo or not or pwede pa rin bang makapasa if less than 6 months yung mga ganun. It's better na ako na mismo yung maka-experience nito kaysa sa mag-research pa ako um, sa iba't ibang sources. So, yun, kinamit ko yung secured credit card ko with Metro Bank less than 6 months. Siyempre, hihingi niya yung um, credit card number mo. Card number ko, nilagay ko doon. And how much is your annual income? Siyempre, <laughs> sasagutin mo rin yan before mo i-check yung I hereby agree to be bound with terms and conditions governing the issuance and use of the Union Bank credit card. And then, i-check mo that you are not a robot and then click next. So, papalabas yung, yung mga declarations na yan tapos scroll down ka hanggang sa umabot ka doon sa dulo at maklik mo na yung accept. Pag-click mo ng accept, lalabas yung second portion of the application process, which is you're going to tell the bank more about yourself. Personal information mo like your first name, your middle name, your last name, your mobile number, email address, birth date, birthplace, 
um, address, tapos may map doon kung saan ipa-plot mo o ilalagay mo yung pin, exact location mo, ipipin mo doon sa map. Yun na yung modern version ng pagsasketch ng location. Bibigay mo rin yung gender mo, mother's maiden name, your government ID and ID number, and like I always say, kapag bangko, expect ka nahahanap po siya ng PIN. Pagkatapos mo i-supply yung mga information na yan, it's better to save. Kung sakali man uh, mag-error or whatever, at least na-save mo na yun, at saka mag-resume, ma-resume mo lang yung application, Next, the bank will ask for your work information. So, this is the tricky part. Kasi parang iso, ito yung may malaking factor for the banks to decide kung um, approve ka or decline. But wala ka namang other route here but to answer as honestly as possible. And make sure that yung whatever answers mo is mababack up mo siya with supporting documents kung sakali hingan ka niya. Hingin niyo yung employment status, yung occupation, nature of business, um, months with the company, years with the company, and phone number, all those information. Now, the reason ko bakit nag-try ako kay Union Bank is I heard the oh, chismis kay sa na nag a si freelancer, yung ganon. So, I want to see kung totoo nga bang ganon because I am a freelancer and I'm sure a lot of you can relate. So, this is the reason kung bakit nag-try ako kay Union Bank. So, once you're done with this page, just click next, save, and then click next. By the way, guys, bago ka pala makapag-proceed ng next, ha, hingi po siya ng the following document. So, depende sa sinagot ko uh, sa work, doon magbabase ko ano yung mga supporting documents yung hihingin niya. Yung hiningi sa akin is driver's license and selfie with my ID. I also think that it's because of the fact na meron na ako account with Union Bank and nung inopen ko kasi yung account ko, hiningan niya na ako ng mga other supporting documents. So, I guess these are the ones na kulang na lang sa kanya. Like I said, I feel like it's much easier to fill out this uh, the application form if meron ka ng existing account with Union Bank because they already have your record on file. Pag kinlik mo yung submit, pagkatapos mo ibigay yung work information, mo, then bibigyan ka niya ng summary ng mga information na binigay mo kay back. And this is a good opportunity for you to review your answers and make sure na tama lahat, walang wrong spelling. Kasi syempre, magba-background check si bank. Hindi maganda kapag hindi consistent yung information mo. So just double check na lahat ng entries mo ay tama before you find yung final ng pag-submit ng um, information mo. So, sa baba, tatanungin niya kung saan mo gustong ipa-deliver yung card kung sakaling approve ka. And then, you have two options. That is home or business. Yung sa akin, pinili ko is home. Kasi wala naman akong business address. <laughs> and then, just click submit. Pagkatapos yan, tatanungin ka niya if sure ka na ba. So, just click I am not a robot and then just click submit at lalabas yung page na ko to kung saan sabi niya thank you for trying <laughs> thank you for submitting your application your credit card reference number is blah 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 and then magsasend daw sila ng update regarding the status and you want to submit another form just a quick advice share ko lang kasi nabasa ko to somewhere na avoid sending multiple applications kapag meron kang pending application so um, pa isa-isa lang one at a time lang kasi Ang daming cases na nadi-decline sila dahil, just because there are multiple applications na detect ng system. Kahit naman sana, pasado sana sa information tsaka um, kung sa documents lang pasado. Pero nadi-decline kasi ang daming applications pending. Since nag-submit na tayo ng information, all we need to do now is wait kung ano man magiging decision ni Bank. Sabi um, sa Facebook, <laughs> mabilis lang daw. But then it looks like hindi, it's been 7 days at wala pa rin akong feedback. So, meron po siyang link kung saan pwede mong i-check yung status. Pero every time I visit that link, mga 7 days na sinasabing under app, uh, pending pa rin and reviewing pa rin daw yung documents. So, yun yung process ng pag-apply ng credit card sa website ni Union Bank. And update ko na lang kayo kung approve or decline. Watch out for it dun sa mga community post ko sa YouTube. And, well, um... We'll see if we'll be able to make more videos about Union Bank na credit card. So, I hope to see you um, on my next vlog. And hopefully, positive view <laughs> news ko sa inyo, yung follow-up ko sa inyo about this. So, let me know what you think. Share your opinion in the comment section below. Suggestions, whatever. And I'll see you on my next vlog. Bye!